everybody. You know we like to do it live. It's Osiris with 15 minutes to show. Guess who we are? Ha ha ha. We are out at the big opening of the Wake Me When I'm Free exhibit of Tupac Shakur. When you go inside, I'm telling you, you're in for a big surprise. It is a 20,000 curated space, very carefully done. They got the brother stuff laid out. So for those of you that are poets, writers, musicians, they got something for everyone, including what they used to wear back in the day. So if you're interested in going, please come out. It's on the corner of Georgia and Olympic Boulevard, downtown LA, LA Live at the Canvas Art Space. So bring your booty, get your cuties, and come on out. Right now, I'm gonna talk to a person that I met some time ago, along with Miss Sheila Ward. Sheila Ward is the legacy manager for the John Singleton Estate. She's also a legacy manager for his body of work. Along with, we have, along with us, Linda and Tognini. Now, for those of you that don't know who this woman is, I met her through another friend from back east, and Linda is the first artist. I don't care what they tell you, she is the first artist that I've ever known to paint to a hip hop artist, and this is her story. Real quick, let me run it down. Real quick, Linda had a big crisis in her life. Her home burned down along with her wonderful husband. They had to rebuild from scratch. She was in the bedroom, so I'm told, and a young black African-American came by, saw her boohooing on the side of the bed and said, what's wrong, my darling? She said, I've lost everything. He said, you know who I listen to when I lose, when I don't feel well? She, he, she said, who? He said, Tupac. She said, who's Tupac? She had two, a radio in a garage where they all were staying. The radio only got two stations. You want to guess which station came through? The hip hop station that had Tupac Shakur on it. The girl's been doing her thing ever since. And I give her a shout out and credit because she's the first one that I know of. I don't care what they tell you. <laughs> this is her work. So I'm going to let her talk and then we're going to switch to Sheila real quick. Okay, so hang tight. Hi, I'm Linda Antonini and I'm the artist and designer behind Project Tupac. For the last 10 years, I have been painting my interpretation of Tupac's music on canvas. Currently, there are 22 paintings in the Project Tupac collection. That is awesome to know. Also, now just so you know, John Singleton, who is the, uh, represented by this legacy manager here, Sheila Ward, John Singleton had started doing something for Tupac. It was a project in the making. Yeah. And I want Miss Sheila Ward to tell you a little bit about that. So you can just be hipping in the now. Let's go. Well, that has been written by John Singleton. It was not made because of uh, the powers that be. However, me, myself, I have copies of that particular script and all of John's scripts for that legacy preservation uh, position that I have now. And I'm happy to be here at this event because Tupac was very special to John. He was uh, going to be working with John after his original project with John, which was uh, Poetic Justice. He was to be in higher learning as well. So thank you for having me here. Oh my gosh, it's wonderful. We're standing with some iconic people here themselves. So again, if you missed it, come out. See it live for yourself. It's riveting. It's amazing. It's emotional. Don't be afraid to cry. It hurts. I'm gonna tell you as a woman of color, it hurts me to see people hanging from trees, to see people that were mistreated. And now those same very people that were mistreated are adored. Our lips, our hips, our butts are now adored. So I'm sure that Tupac will be very, very proud to see that his legacy and what he talked about back in the day is coming true. We have this artist, Lennon Ed Tognini, that again, never heard of hip hop, all started painting to the man's music. Look at what she did. Brenda's she, got a baby. Brenda's got a baby, and there are a lot of Brenda's out there with babies, and you guys know what I'm talking about. We also have the legendary, iconic Sheila Ward. I want you to know who this woman is. She is not only the legacy preservation, she is not only the legacy preservation manager of John Singleton, she is the mother of John Singleton. It doesn't get any better than this. I'm sorry, boo for you, yay for us. We get to talk to these people. So the next time you're in town, if you're not here for the weekend, come on by, hang out with 15 Minutes to Show. 
you know you want to check out Linda Antonini's website. Her website is lindaantonini.com. <laughs> lindaantonini.com. There's some special stuff on there. She is Italian. Do you understand me? I love Italian. <laughs> She's Italian. They did a whole thing in the country of Italy showing the power of art with Tupac's music, her art, and a lot of kids from all over the world, especially Italian kids, dancing to his music. Can I say she's my friend? And <laughs> they are friends. Now, I met Sheila through Linda. We met many, many years ago. So we're coming full circle while all of us are here together at this moment in time doing the Tupac exhibition again come out go to my channel 15 minutes to show you know you want to show me some love please <laughs> I need all the love I can get and put your finger on there and subscribe and meanwhile do you have a website no website no, no website. website you just know her name you know how to get in touch with Linda you'll know how to get in touch with me okay, okay. LinkedIn you'll find her profile on LinkedIn and that's the end of our show come back don't forget Say hello, share your heart for Valentine's Day, and we'll talk to you soon. That's been another 15 minutes.